to Montana Haven Vacation Rental. Well, friends, the time has finally come. Mm -hmm. Finally come. Yes. <laughs> I mean, literally. <laughs> yes. The moment you've been waiting for, it's here. Yeah. And our vacation rental is literally set up and ready 99.9%. .9%. Yeah. yeah. Uh, we have been working exceedingly hard. Yeah, we, we are <laughs> exhausted. We are ready to leave for Alaska yep. again for the third time. And I say again because literally this is the third time we have tried to go. We've been turned back at the border twice. I'll, I'm going to say that in a completely different video and tell you that story. But today we're going to show you our vacation rental. Yeah. We're moving to Alaska for a short term, probably a couple of years. And Priscilla spent an ex exorbitant amount of time and energy to make this place beautiful mm -hmm. inside and the children and I worked outside mm -hmm. we did a lot of landscaping and we just did a ton of projects and we're very happy very excited it turned out beautiful yeah we think it did <laughs> so now we're gonna take you around and show you should you chance to want to stay at Montana Haven and we think that you do mm -hmm. um, it's beautiful and we're gonna show you around so first of all what you're seeing us sitting on here is our our deck that faces the mountains mm -hmm. um, and this is a, a big deck I don't know what the square footage is but uh, it's very big we have a, a table uh, right over here and we'll show that to you in a minute and that is a table that actually comes from my parents door uh, that my sister made like uh, 30 years ago and so we hand carved it and made it into a table that's sitting right here we have a barbecue grill on the porch that you can use uh, we have a glider uh, that you can use and we have these chairs that you can use. We want you to sit here and enjoy the evening mm -hmm. or the day, the sunsets. So let's show you around. Yeah, make yourself a cup of coffee and come out here and sit on the porch and just enjoy the quietness. Yes, it's beautiful out here. Mm -hmm. So we're going to show you now the mountains. The sun has just set about 30 minutes ago and this, it's beautiful right now. So let me, let me show you that. And there they are, in all their beauty. You can hear the nighthawks out there. And the evening birds. Okay, now I want to take off our cover and I will show you this table. And this table, you can actually eat off of if you like. And it's kind of special. We put all our names and stuff in it, and the boys drew pictures, and we epoxied it. So this is a table that you can use. Okay, let's take you into the front door. And right in here, we have just a little entryway. It's not big. But it'll do. And here you have got you've got closets you can open up and there's a light switch right here. You've got plenty of closet space while you're while you're here and a little table and a nook to uh, lay your keys down, yep, whatever you yep. need. And then you'll come in here to the dining area and the kitchen. Mm -hmm. And what do you want to say about the kitchen, babe? So right when you come in we have like the welcome to our home. Montana Haven, where you can read about just anything about our home and about attractions around here. And then we leave you a little card and some wine for you to enjoy. And then over here, on this thing right here, we got a guest book that we would love if you would sign. Yes, please do. Or then just write a little note on one of these cards. And just let us know how you enjoyed your stay. Okay, next let's go check out the kitchen, shall we? So I think you'll find almost anything that you need here in the kitchen. We've got two ovens and a microwave. I've got uh, some seasonings here for anyone who wants to cook while they're here. And we've got a coffee nook over here. And then over on this corner is like a little tea area. You can make your own tea and... Nice big refrigerator, yep. a freezer. We have a dishwasher, mm -hmm. and we've got a nook in here with like a toaster and some items in there. 
Um, you're going to find the uh, garbage cans in here. Yeah. And we have a butcher block and a copper sink right here. Mm -hmm. And what else? Uh, here's where their silverware is. And we have lots of plates and bowls and mugs. Right. Lots of Just things in here. Lots of things kitchen's that you can full of things. <laughs> Next, we're taking you into the dining room and the living room area. You have often seen, seen us sit here and eat, so when you come, you can sit around the table and eat just like we did. And <laughs> you can actually expand this table. All yeah, you, you have can. to do is one person goes to each end of the table, pulls it, it expands another like two feet out, and you can have a few more people sit at the table. <laughs> and this living room steps down. Yes, sunken living room. Mm -hmm. And then here is where you can sit and enjoy your coffee, your tea, and um, we just put some candles in here, some remote control candles, candles that you can just put on and enjoy if you like. And the remote is in here, and just due to fire safety and concerns, we've decided, I know you, you like fireplaces and I like fires too, but we've decided to not have fires in here while we're away just for the safety's mm -hmm. sake and smoke. If you don't know how to run this thing, it's got a couple different levers and you know switches and things. It just it can kind of get smoky really fast in here, yeah. so kind of kind of complicated. So we've just decided to we have a heating system, so we have the candles, and you're gonna stay nice and warm. Yeah, and you can enjoy some of my natural plants in here. So here's something that's a little cool. You can, if you want to sit here, you can uh, literally just pull this up like this, and then you can sit here and you can either have a coffee or you can look at our photo books from past years uh, that we have here and there's some coasters for your coffee so that's all you have to do if you want to enjoy uh, a coffee or a snack right here on the couch in this chest in the living room we have a bunch of extra blankets so if it's a chilly night or you need more blankets feel free to use these right here okay now we're gonna take you into the master bedroom suite And here, the first thing you're going to find is you have um, a armoire with lots of drawers and, and doors on here to store all your clothes while you're in here. And we have a chair here for you, a lamp to sit, and we have a plush bed here. And may I add, it's king size. Yes, a king size. With a brand new mattress, so hopefully yeah. it's comfortable for you. Yep. And we have a big walk-in closet, so you can go right in there, and there's two sides for ladies and guys, and you can hang all your clothes in there. And while you're in here, you might want to have a coffee out on this deck. So let's go check out this deck. Okay, so now you have a balcony out here with two chairs, and it's kind of dark out, so you can't really see it. I will have to take some better photos for you tomorrow. Uh, but there's a little balcony, and you can sit out here and kind of look towards the back side. Like in the morning, it's perfect because this is where in the east where the sun comes up. So this is a nice spot for the morning. Uh, to enjoy your coffee out here if you want to have some real private time and nobody else around. So the master bedroom uh, has its own bathroom right here and these are saloon doors that you can open up and go right inside. Okay. So here in the master bathroom we have a big jetted tub that you can enjoy and we have a shower over here. A glass shower. Mm -hmm. And then on the sink here I have some some like shampoos, conditioner, body wash, and the soap bar. And I have some makeup washcloth here and makeup remover wipes. And I have some toothbrushes and toothpaste and a shaver in case anybody forgets theirs. And then in the drawer here, I have a blow dryer and I even have a flat iron in here that's, I just had extra, so I just kept it here. Perfect. Yeah, and a lot of towels for you guys. And you have a makeup mirror yeah. as well right here. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and uh, go, on st go to the uh, powder room and the laundry room. Yeah. Okay, so from the kitchen and uh, dining room area, this is how you're going to get to your powder room. So this is a half bath right here. It's got a toilet and it's got a vessel sink. Now let's check out the laundry area. I've kept it very clean. There's a lot of space in here. 
So over here I have some laundry baskets and some laundry soap and fabric softener sheets for you all to use. And then also if you have something to hang up, you can hang your clothes on here. Then over here on this corner, we have an ironing board and an iron for you to use if you like. Okay, let's head on upstairs, shall we? So here we are in what we call our family area. There's just a big open mm -hmm. space where children can play, where you can watch movies. We have some new couches here. Mm -hmm. A new sofa and a new recliner. And these actually have uh, leg rests and recline as well. Mm -hmm. We have, we do not have TV here. So we, we never have had TV, So but you, we have lots of DVDs in VHS's to enjoy if mm -hmm. you want. And if you have like a Roku stick that you want to bring, this is not a smart TV, but you can plug in a Roku stick if you want to. Mm -hmm. If you want to watch that, there is internet here, but we just don't have TV. Mm -hmm. So there's lots of videos and there's uh, three remotes. One remote is for the screen. One is for the Bose uh, speaker if you want extra volume. And the third one is for the DVD VCR player and they're all right here. And they are labeled on the back what they are. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then over here we have a bookshelf with uh, children's books and young adult books. Lots of good wholesome books. And then we also have a little air hockey game here. As well as a chess board built in the floor right here. We, chess or checkers. we just don't have chess pieces. I guess we <laughs> <laughs> Bring your own chess pieces. Um, yeah, we, ha we might have to get some for that. Yeah, we just we thought do. of that. We, did, we, we don't have do. any. For that yeah. okay let's go into the uh, guest one when, when we have guests at our home this is typically where they will stay so this is like the guest room yes in our home so we invite you to come inside okay so in this room you have a queen's queen size bed mm -hmm. um, and this also has an exterior balcony uh, with a light that goes is on on the outside so you can also enjoy uh, the outside up here if you want and this also faces east so it's got its own balcony and two chairs And then we also have like a little sitting area in this guest bedroom With a fi little fireplace and, and it creates ambience or it has heat if you mm -hmm. want a little bit of extra heat in here You can turn the heat on. Yeah A little quiet place. This is one of my favorite places in the house and Priscilla's to sit It's yeah. quiet and it's pleasant mm -hmm. and it's kind of special place up here. Yeah so now we have to stop the video and we have to apologize because we're literally, like we mentioned, moving tomorrow. And we just, just today, we actually finished, um, you know, getting everything set up and we're doing this at night. Mm -hmm. So unfortunately, it's a little dark. We apologize. We'll try to get a little video in the morning still. Mm -hmm. um, but it's, this is kind of the only time that we have had to do it. So, and we'll also direct you to our vacation rental site. Just click on the description link and that'll take you to uh, the place where you can look at more photos. Yeah, and the pictures will be better there. Yes. <laughs> Alright, let's take you now into the guest bath. So here you have, um, you know, your vanity and you have a shower with lights in it. A tub and shower. Yeah, yep. tub and shower. And you also have a view. This is pretty important. If you're sitting on the toilet and you're sitting here for a while rather than being on your phone or reading a magazine You can just look out and you can enjoy the mountains. That's kind of nice <laughs> Yeah, and this bathroom actually has two doors because we only have one bathroom up here And so, yeah, so if you're staying in here and you you're you want privacy you just lock this yes. this door here And then this is your own mm -hmm. private bathroom. Yeah. Okay, let's go to the last two bedrooms So let's go in Avalon and Chloe's room and this bed is is a full bed and but it's a cute little room we have my mom's picture there in the back that she painted yeah that she painted and then back here in the corner there's a little chair you can relax in and this is a what do you call this unit a Euro dresser, dresser. Mm -hmm. uh, with Priscilla's name on it I gave this to her when as, we were dating yeah when we were dating yeah. so <laughs> Not stuff in Avalon's room, and then you have yeah. a little closet here to hang your things. Yeah. So let's go check out Justin, Ethan, and Wyatt's room. 
Okay, so in this room, you're going to see this is a guy's room. So mm -hmm. <laughs> they have got a lot of their trophies in here. These are things that they've shot over the years. And if you're an outdoorsy type of person, this might be the room you gravitate to. If you're not, you might not want to stay in here. But it is pretty cool. It's got a lot of their mounts in here. Um, but you have a full bed on the bottom and a twin on top. So you can sleep three people in this room. You have a nice recliner here. And also you have a beautiful view of the mountains. Yep. This is the bedroom that has the best view of the mountains in it, actually. Yeah. And it's got its own closet as well with two dressers. Well, I just had to come out and take a little bit of video footage from our landscaping that we put in. I'm pretty happy that it, the way it turned out. I think it looks so good. We got all our lights up here. And I just turned off the lights to the entrance so that you can see a little bit better what it looks like. But yeah, it looks pretty good. I'll get some better footage during the day tomorrow. You can even see the mountains. It's about 11 o'clock right now. Look how bright it is. Isn't that amazing? I guess in Alaska, it's pretty much gonna be daylight, but here we're almost at the longest day of the year. Okay, well, it is just about time to leave. I want to do one more quick shot of the front here and the landscaping, what it looks like. We're loading up everything and we're getting ready to take off in just a couple minutes here. But that's the, the view of our house and those are the new walks that we put in. Are you excited to go, Abby? Yeah. All right, I want to show you the front here. We got some lilacs and some hanging baskets here. Uh, this uh, old pieces of wood here, we went up in the woods and we, on top of the mountain, our mountain here, and we got some of that. We've got a table there to sit on, and some chairs. And there's another piece of wood we have in there and just a lot of different landscaping. So there you go. I uh, hope you and are gonna enjoy staying in here. And there you can see the Balconies back here. It's a beautiful home and we're sad to miss it, but we're looking forward to our next adventure. Of course, you can't forget about our barn out here and the treehouse above that. We spend a lot of time making that beautiful as well. The boys put a lot of time in their treehouse. Make sure you go and check that out if you would like, but you gotta be really careful. It's really high and and we don't want you to fall or anything. So Proceed with caution and be responsible. And so there it is. And we're off.